Hello everyone, today we are going to study chapter 7. In this chapter, we will talk about light and object. Let us start. Light. We can see things or everything around us because of light. Now before we will start, we will read first our vocabulary words. Please repeat after me. Light. Object. Transparent. Again. Light, object, and transparent. Now, light. Light is the brightness that comes from the sun, fire, or torch that allow things to be seen. So light enables us to see things around us. Next, object. Object is a thing that you can see or touch. Examples are glasses, camera, ball, or anything that can be seen or touch. Next, transparent. It is allowing light to pass through so that objects can be clearly seen through it. Or in other words, it is clear. Examples are clear glasses and clear coin bank. Okay, what word do you see? Yes, it is light. How about this one? Okay, it is also light. Now remember, Light enables us to see things around us. If there is no light, do you think we can see anything? Yes, definitely we couldn't. So light is not only produced by our sun. It is also produced by other different light sources such as torch, lamp, candle, stars, or even fire. Furthermore, light can heat objects. It can heat as human. It can heat our skin, hair, or anything. So when light heats an object, the amount of light that can pass through the object depends on the type of object, meaning different objects or different materials allows different amount of light to pass through them. Since we already talked about light, next thing we will talk is about object. Remember, objects are things that can be seen or touched. So, there are three types of objects that allows different amount of light to pass through them. First is transparent object, second translucent object, and third is opaque object. Now, transparent. From the word transparent, what comes into your mind? Yes, it is clear, meaning we can see everything, right? There are a lot of examples of transparent objects. Most objects around us are transparent. Let us study more about transparent objects. Now, transparent objects, they are the one that allow all light to pass through them. That is why we can clearly see the image or the inside of the transparent objects. Now, examples of transparent objects are clear glasses, clear plastics, and even water. Now, another example of transparent objects are fishbowl and aquarium. Now, both of them are made of clear glass. Everything inside a fishbowl and aquarium, like fish and pebbles, are seen clearly because light passes through them. All the light coming from the light source is allowed to pass through them. Now, next example is laboratory apparatus. These are instruments used in the experiments in the laboratory. Now, they are made of clear glasses for us to see the measurements of the liquids. Now, examples of laboratory apparatus are beaker, test tubes, cylinder, and Erlenmeyer flask. So, it's review time! What enables us to see things around us? Yes, it's light. Next, remember object is a collection of matter or objects are those that can be seen or touched. Now, objects differ in the amount of light that is being allowed to pass through them. Remember, there are three types of object. First is transparent, translucent, and opaque. Again, what are the three types? Okay, very good. Now, Transparent objects, they are the one that allow all light to pass through them. A clear image is seen using transparent object. Examples of transparent objects are air, glass, 
laboratory apparatus, and clear plastic. Time to answer. Let us check your understanding. Let us try to practice with these exercises. And that's all for today. See you next time. Bye-bye.